Oh, hello. Welcome to my smoking room. I'd like to introduce you to my friend. This is a, this is a vaping advocacy podcast. A mushroom vaping advocacy podcast. Vaping shroom fumes. This is an antique uh, cigarette setting. I love stuff like this. Look, I mean, you know, if I could find uh, the craftsman, perhaps. But, but here we have the, the cigarette container, the tray. We have the, the ashtray, which is really interesting. And these line up to grooves in the bowl. Brass, brass and uh, copper. Very nicely done. So, today's video was going to be us two just shooting the shit and talking to you about vaping. Vaping in a, in a public setting. Vaping indoors without the shame of, of doing something naughty. So so anyway, uh, this 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 particular episode would have been us just to vaping. Unfortunately I, I noticed that uh, my audio from last video is, is slightly off. So I would like to uh, reiterate or recap what I was talking to then. You bring you guys up to speed a little bit more sensibly. Okay, so I have a six mushroom blend. Let me, let me talk to you for a second. I have a six mushroom blend. Six mushrooms blended. Right? I handpicked them. Just like old country people hand picking things, but 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 more more precisely, I cherry picked the National Institute of Health documents in the previous video. You can see that they're, the ones I picked are all related to the, the pulmonary system. So if you're smoking cigarettes all your life and you want to quit, but you want to give up the the coolness of being able to. Right? That's the whole point. The whole point of smoking was to have something to do. That dramatic pause. Here, I'm medicating myself, friend. I'm medicating myself. Friend. Okay, so what I have for you is, is what I'm putting together. A six mushroom blend. Mushroom one, agaricon. If you look very closely, it has great copy on it. Boost immunity, reduce inflammation, breathe easier, long life. So number one, you're already saying to yourself, hey, you know, that uh, sounds good. I mean, he's smoking it. It's mushroom. The FDA said, yes, you can now market mushrooms as, as medicinal. And, and so my second one is a turkey tail. Part of the blend. This says immune support and defense. So what more defense would you need in, in case of toxins in your lungs? So the next one would be, I said cordyceps. You remember cordyceps. Everybody's looked up cordyceps. Everybody knows that this is the mushroom that makes ants zombies. Well, what, does it, what does it do for us? Energy support, immune balancing properties. Far from the zombified ants. We are people. Mind you, we eat mushrooms. Mushrooms don't eat us. 
the next one, Chaga. Chaga is important as well. Look the importance of Chaga. For thousands of years, the, the, the Russians are the steppes, the steppes of Russia, the people, the indigenous people were putting this in hot water, drinking it like we drink coffee. I add it to my coffee. Lion's mane, that's for your neural system, your your nerves, your your oh no. Focus, clarity, and mood. And the crude de gras is tiger milk. Here. All right, in case you can't see it, because I can't see it. Healthy lungs, strong immune system, energy, and stamina. Which which are the things that, that you want from your lungs. Uh, the tiger's milk is happens to be the analog to our lungs in the mushroom world. So we have these, these deep-rooted indigenous mushrooms they all say these are the ones, these are the ones, these are the ones, these are the ones. They found these little, and, and, and these are the ones, and these are the ones. These are ailments. These are the ones. They would say this is called ghost bread for crying out loud. The Native Americans call this ghost bread. There's a version of it in Europe that grew on large trees. So indigenous population worldwide know these things. This, this is this is your 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 great grandmother's medicine cabinet. See, the, unfortunately, what we had to do is we had to close the door on that being medicinal. They just released mushrooms to be marketed in 2017, marketed as medicinal. This is a supplement. This is a supplement. So that supplement. I buy the supplement. But I provide you to smoke it. This is what I'm doing for you. I can't get around this until I find uh, the, the DNA of the mushroom. Perhaps we can do a DNA culture. So part of what I was telling you about yesterday was uh, the... The, the devices that I have and what I'm using them for, like, for example, this is the Vupu Air, uh, Argus Air. This is the Vupu Argus Air. It says Argus on the side. It's air because you have, see them? See them? There's a pinhole there. There's no pinholes here. So the direction that you put this, you get either full, full on cigar, or full on cigarette. So it's a real cool setup on this. I can I can calibrate it, its amount of juice it uses. Wait, will this work? Yeah. All right. So it has all those neat, those neat things in LED display. This, this is my cigar. This is a C apostrophe G A R, a play on agar corn, the cigar. Right. I would I would package this as the cigar. My primary my primary unit that I, I use when I'm at home is, is this. This is the, uh, the V made by Wupu. It, it features a a um, protective mouthpiece. This is for people on the go. I, I use it at home because I want to show you guys this. 
I don't want to lose it. That's what I'm saying. So I want to be able to say I got this. It's kind of like in this type of setting, this is the perfect utensil. You could you have this, you, you have a two-step operation going on here. You take your vape. And, and, it, and this is a very delicious version of the vape as far as the different uh, types of elements to heat up. This is this is my, my run around town. I have two of these. And it has uh deal on it so the cool thing about what's going on with these the ones on the charge at the moment is that i have been playing with it's there it goes you see the number right now it's been around it goes nine 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 is the top i went around twice this is going to be the third time around essentially on on this tip its brother has the same thing is getting near the, the 30,000 mark. Now I, I, I say that I say that loosely because 500 is a long way away. But I, still what I'm, what, I'm, what I'm saying is uh, well by 4,000 is a long way away. Excuse me. So what I'm saying is until they die, I'm going to see what the numbers are and write it down. I have write, written down certain things on it. But, but the, the Lufu line went ahead and, and uh, forged these units to be sent to the FDA for the approval for the FDA. The, the FDA says, oh, so they're smoking it, and, and oh, wow, th th they can protect from contaminants? Great. Okay, they can have that. They, they said, uh, oh, oh, wow, they can monitor their, their intake. Okay. Oh, look at that. And this, this one here is programmable, meaning that there, I can get them to give me the, the, the whatever the deal is and, and, and request what program I want and it would do what I want, maybe. I don't know how, how, how far it goes, but they said part of the selling thing is you plug it in on a computer, it goes online, and it updates, whatever. Okay, so so that's the line that I want to want to sell with my goo, my Shroom fume vaping fluid. Okay. I, I, I put it in the, a box. See, this says plant therapy essential oils. But essentially, this is essential oils. So I got, I got a 24. See, look, look. No blue lights going in there, brother. No blue lights going in there. All right. Because what happens when UV light hits things? That you don't want destroyed, it destroys it. Okay, so so so, getting back to to a blend of six mushrooms. Now, what you may or may not have experienced when you're smoking mushrooms. When I first started my mushroom cycle, I brought this. I dropped it. This is this is 2017. Right, 2017 saw me buy this and make per capsule 100 mil or 90 milliliters in here and 10 milliliters of tobacco juice, right? Or, you know, uh, uh, nicotine, uh, which is you know nicotine, right? So, so 10 milliliters of nicotine. Okay. Now, in order for me to get nicotine anymore, I have to get a license. So I can't do the nicotine part, but but doesn't doesn't hurt my calculations. It actually helps my calculations. So one of these for for ninety milliliters of these, right now I'll be saying a hundred milliliters because I round up because I was putting that in. So so essentially what I was doing, I was making um, the mushrooms since two thousand seventeen as a vape. So. I use lion's mane on, on this, this. This one says lion's mane. Right here. Lion's mane. Turkey tail. Rishi. Cordyceps. Mitaki. And Chaga. Okay. And you're like, well, you said Rishi and Mitaki. 
and I say those belong in your plate. Oh, just kidding. But like, like for example, I can go ahead and, and use reishi, but but uh, I found that reishi is the sleeping mushroom. So I have an issue with sleeping my whole life, and and having smoking knees, it really brought me back to a, a cycle of sleep that was just different. I, I wasn't used to it. Now now my cat's used to that, and she taps me if you see my nose. She she uses a little claw to to make sure she's got my attention now when when I pass out and I'm afraid that she's going to touch my eyelid and pop an eye out so I have to get up so that's my my fear of her but that's besides the point so anyway I was using these particular mushrooms I dropped mitake and reishi in favor of agaricon and tiger smoke now the reason being is I wanted to go further into the restorative capacity of mushrooms in our lungs. Most people, most people that enjoy vaping, really enjoy vaping and enjoy that invigorating feeling. So here, here's a vaping without the nicotine. Now, you know, so, so at least this is a public setting smoke. So, as I discussed, this is what I was getting into. What did I do first? I brought this and this. So, so this is one gram of six mushrooms, right? One gram of six mushrooms. I mean, each mushroom had 1.37 milligrams in it, or 167, 167, it says here on the back says 167 milligrams of each mushroom so i did that with mine when i got this the reason why i said when is because this was putting me to sleep too much so i thought let me get away from that and, and get the stuff i want and i did my research i looked everything up i have a, a report shown for you so I have an interesting sidebar on this. Now you say, well, why use a cigar when I can go to the store and get this? Okay, this right here is, is a perfect example of the commercial vaping device. Pod system. I enjoy pod systems. Right? Other people like these other systems. Woo Poo has you covered. Woo Poo has you covered. I'm not, I'm not kidding. So I'm selling a dream, an idea. You can sell whatever. But here, look, this is this is a uh, commercially received uh, device, and, and this pod is 1.8 milliliters, and this pod is three milliliters. On my my day to day, guys, this is two milliliters. So it's, it's, this is like 22 cigarettes to this 20 cigarettes. So a cigarette is 0 0.09 milliliters. That's crucial because I was making 90 milliliters. Get it? 0 0.09 milliliters, 90 milliliters. Right? Dun, dun, dun. Oh, you see, you were adding nicotine. Yes, yes, but I haven't added nicotine since uh, December 31st. Since January of this year, I've been smoking complete and nothing but mushrooms. Thank you, 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 thank you. I know it's it's an achievement, you know. And I was going heavy on nicotine too, because I had the last source of nicotine. I bought my nicotine. I was buying nicotine in in in, uh, in, in my in the glycerin myself because. I didn't like the flavors available, and I didn't like it bland. And then, then look at this. This covers the flavors. This covers the triterpenes that are in mushrooms. It's phenomenal. You, you have not only a flavor like cigarettes, but you have the whole envelopment of your head. You have all your senses going on to it. It fires everything. It's, it's like um, when, when you smoke a, a cigarette, you, it goes into your lungs. 
right? You could hold it in your mouth and you could feel the sting. With this, the the the, the it's not like a flavor as more of an experience. It fills your head. It has it has that that mushroom. You know when you bite into a mushroom, you know it's a mushroom because of that 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 experience. Much more than the flavor is part of what's going on. Well, that's what's going on with the vape too, right? Plus, in a social setting, nobody's going to be upset because you're smoking something noxious. This is all all medicinal. Okay, so. What I was saying is, is, is I took the idea from here, 0.09 milliliters of cigarette, I mixed, and I weighed it out. I weighed it out. I got this, I got this, this, because it has a air dam set up. I could perhaps discourage... Because you're essentially weighing out dust. So a gram each, I mix them into a vesicle from my days of smoking. A gram of each weighed out, put in there, mixed there then mixed in with glycerin, the 70-30 composition glycerin, 70 uh, VG and 30 PG glycerin. And most manufacturers have built their coils to burn that ratio. And that's why I want to, I, I, that's why I bought that directly from the manufacturer. <clears throat> so when I was doing it this way, right, with, with this, the, these six that were coming with me, I filtered it through here. So so that's roughly a half a cup. A half a cup. This is a cup. But, but, but I would filter it through here. And I would end up with a lot of pulp. A lot of body left over. That's not good. So by, by ethanol extraction, I get hardly any pulp left over. Uh, it, it, out, of, out of 900 uh, milliliters, it was, it was a dusting. It was a dusting. Look, look like look like a, a look like an iron blade into the rug circle, right? Nothing that substantial. So here's here's two cups, right? Sixteen ounces. That's the fluid that burns the knee. So essentially, that was basically what I was talking about in the last video. And then the fact that I want to set up a spa. I, I want to have a, a smoking lounge. This is my smoking lounge. But but this is this is my house. The smoking lounge. Or, or the room, my, you know, the sitting room, <laughs> sitting area of my room. We have, we have a, a small studio space. We call it the Palmacita. And, and I have it in the pre previous video as well. So... What I want to do is I want to set up a, a, a smoke lounge so people can enjoy vaping, have, have it set up so that each room is positively or negatively pressured so you have areas of clean. It would be modern day spa uh, smoking lounge, um, having a, a pool tables, or areas of, of simple exercise, areas of, of, of mind uh, athletics and body motions because perhaps uh, my uh, the if I talk a pulmonologist into setting a practice with me he would have my guests and his own rotation of, of uh, patients so we have the the correlating uh, positive negative areas so that his patients can come and go without a fear of infecting others. That sounds funny, doesn't it? But but if you looked at my paperwork for these, guess what? This helps. Lung ailments. 
so so perhaps we can sort of get a a, a cross uh, e example with his use but but my point is much less that much more to have a lounge spa setting people are like wow i can get seen to this is going to be a great thing i get to sit get to be massaged i can get to sit over here and play a video game i get to have a, a small area for a podcast such as this so i i can run this while, while i have a, a social setting ultimately large area and i would like to use an escape bar with mushroom cakes aha uh -huh. Uh, not only garicorn, but there is uh, what is called the chicken of the forest, which is a mushroom. And you can be, be uh, drafted into mushroom cakes for coffee. You have an escapade bar with chaga. And then you have the whole experience. This is this is a lounge. You have, you have a reading area, a quiet area. You have this and that. And have a large greenhouse area to where you could raise mushrooms in its shrubbery, but it's more uh, of a, an indoor-outdoor space. For, for a large dance hall for people to come and, and enjoy the, their freedom. I can invite uh, acts. I can invite all sorts of potential uh, um, live entertainment. People, uh, the talk shows that like, that like to go live to locations. This is the perfect setting for it. So th th that's my idea. That's my dreams. But, but, but first off, let's, let's get you guys making this stuff. Thank you very much for watching. Have a beautiful day.